TV! Let's watch Jockeys in Space! <laughs> it's not safe! But Star Captain Eagle! <laughs> Can I poke it with a stick? Okay. Hero rule number 74. <gasps> Always be suspicious of things that weren't there before. Looks safe to me. Doctors in space! Wait! It's not even plugged in! She walked into the city and didn't come back. I don't know what missing in actions is, but I sure wish someone would find her. I'll help you look, Topher. We'll find your mama together. Building shifts occur at random and without warning, but with the Bureau's cutting-edge technology, we can stabilize the oldest house. Safe employees are happy employees. Certain rituals allow agents to navigate the oldest house as well. 
but accidents do happen. <laughs> Trapping agents inside the walls. I heard you got stuck in your room for three days, Topher. Too bad you didn't have your book with you. Or any food. And remember, kids, when you feel the floor deviate, it's already much too late. I can see you're upset, Meg. Why don't you tell Uncle Mr. Bones what's wrong? I did bad on my clairvoyance test. You can't ace every test, Meg. You see, everyone has different brains. Some brains can talk to each other. We call this ESP. ESP? <laughs> Some brains can lift objects, like a baseball. Talk about a fly ball, eh, Meg? <laughs> no interruptions! So who cares if you fail your clairvoyance test? Maybe your brain can throw baseballs, or talk to dead people, or make friends blind. Once we know what your brains can do, we'll know what job to give you. And if your brains are just right, you'll get to sit in the big chair. <laughs> What if I don't want the big chair? What if I don't want the big chair? Everyone wants the big chair, Meg! That's why we're all here. Use those brains to listen for once, or the only chair you'll get in is the one with straps. <laughs> <laughs> 